What's up, taters? This is Tree of Logic. Welcome to the Treehouse News YouTube channel. How y'all doing, okay? Listen, today's Thursday. I will have my live stream. You guys know I live stream every Monday and Thursday. And I admit I've been a little slacking with the videos, but here I am now. So let's get busy. Now, listen, I got a treat for you guys. I have not seen the second uh, episode of the turtle freezing up. I haven't. And I find it funny because like, look, dude, term limits, term limits. It's like, what's the problem but then again if we do that then they're gonna have to talk about poopy pants joe biden which we're gonna talk about that okay and so uh we're gonna let's just first of all let's get my reaction my unique reaction to the turtle freezing up for the second time i'm sure i don't even have to play the first time he did this i did a video on it and so i need to keep up with the trends honey if i covered it the first time i gotta cover it when he does it again and again and again so here we go with him freezing up here we go senator you're up for election in three short years what are your thoughts on it Sorry, I had a hard time hearing you. That's okay. What are your thoughts on running for re-election in 2026? What are my thoughts about what? Running for re-election in 2026. Oh. That's good. Did you hear the question, Santa? Before you guys get all triggered, tell us some treat. That is a serious medical condition. Hold on. <laughs> he started staring into the abyss. <laughs> when, when he asked him about getting re basically for a re-election, isn't that what happened? Hold on a second. Isn't that? Isn't that? Hold on. Let me let's look. Cause he's like, well, what about your thoughts on getting re-elected? He was like, hold on. Let's look at this again. What am I talking about? What? Running for re-election. Yeah, running for re-election. Then he thinks somebody like, Rhea. Hold on, I got to talk like the turtle. Re-election. Oh, no. Not that again. Oh, Lordy. Shut down. <laughs> Listen, y'all give me a hard time about this. I'm just going to just, you know, I'm just going to cut you out and ban you. All right, here we go. Let's do it again. <laughs> I don't like the turtle. All right, you should have never ran for re-election. In 2026. Oh. That's right. There you go. He's staring into hell right now. <clears throat> Did you hear the question, Senator? Running for re-election in 2026? All right, I'm sorry, you all. We're going to need a minute. So she automatically said, we're going to need a medic. So this is not the first time he's done this. And even when she comes... And do you see how she yells at him? Now, let me tell you something. I had, um, I had unfortunately, had to watch my grandmother go through alzheimer's and this is what they do um, now i don't know if this is a neurological uh or nerve condition or whatever i know he's not having a stroke some people were saying that the last time no that's not the case he's zoning out and i think uh because this happened to my godmama when she would tell a story she would just zone out and then she would just stare and then she'll look around and she's, she was like, and it would hurt my heart. I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have told that uh, story. But anyway, I just told it anyway. Let me finish it up. She would, when she come out of her zone, she'll look at me. And she said, oh, who are you, baby? What's your name? And I'm like, oh my God, it just, it crushed my soul. Like my grandmama telling me a story and she, she just zones out. And so I don't know if that's what this is. 
But when someone comes up to you and yell, and, and my mama, my, my uh, cousins, and my uncles would do that with my, my grandmother. They would just, like, yell, and it snaps her out of it, and most of the times it doesn't. And that's what this looks like it's doing. Let me see. That's what she looked like she's doing. She's walking up to yell, and he's not responding. <clears throat> Did you hear the question, Senator? Running for re-election in 2026? Yeah. All right, I'm sorry, you all, we're gonna need a minute. Penny. Okay. Yeah, that, that's, that's exactly what my grandmama did. So he's, so he's back. It's like, it's like they just leave. <sighs> It's like a certain part of their consciousness just go away. And then after a while, it comes back. And then they're like, oh, okay, this is what's going on. So that's, it looks like that's just what happened. That it looks like that's exactly what happened right here. That he snaps back into it. <clears throat> okay. Somebody else have a question? Please speak up. Um, what efforts is Daniel Cameron going to have to make on the campaign trail to win Kentuckians over in November? Senator Daniel Cameron, do uh, you have a comment on Daniel Cameron? Well, I think these other races are going to be very close. Uh, <clears throat> far and away the best candidate we could have nominated. And, uh, State has become increasingly Republican. In fact, the governor is the only Democrat left in the country. So I'm optimistic that Daniel will. Be Dude, let him get. Oh my God, put him in a home somewhere. This is elder abuse. Now I feel bad laughing because now this. No, actually, I don't. I, I don't care. I don't. I don't feel sorry for my enemies. I can't. I didn't laugh about. I mean, I I laugh about McCain. I didn't feel sorry for him, and I'm not gonna feel sorry for the turtle. But I do know he need to get out of there and get a fresh young Republican who's not a rhino to take his spot. I think we can do one more. Senator, what is your Why name? are you doing more? <laughs> oh my God! Question on Trump's latest indictment. Would you support him as a nominee? It's a question about Trump. I'm not going to comment about the presidential race. He's either on the Republican side or the Democrat. He didn't even hear it. He just looked away from the reporter and just turned his ear to her. And she's like, it's about Trump. <laughs> Look, watch this again. Watch this again. Watch this again. So now he done checked out because he's like, I don't understand what this man here, what this man's saying. I can't hear a thing. Let me go over here to my interpreter, my translator. What he say? What? It's a question about Trump. I'm not going to comment about the presidential race. Either, either on the Republican side or the Democratic side. Okay. So, thank you all. Okay. Thank you. Sorry. Thank you. I am so shocked right now. Holy smokes. Wow. Oh my God. You know what? So <clears throat> that was worse than I thought. Okay, for real. So it's like we need him out of there. Uh, Feinstein definitely. Oh, she can barely have her eyes open. When you are so old that you need other people to coach you, that's a problem. I mean, do we need to remember about poopy pants Biden? Okay. Like, we are such a laughing stock worldwide. We got all these old people that are in political power, political position of power, and they won't go nowhere. They won't leave. They just was like, no, nope. it's, it's as if they're the king or the queen or something where they're not. 
And we're sitting here saying, wait a minute, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, wait a minute, hold on. You're too old. So when are we going to really make the Republicans, since they control the House, and yeah, it's a little half and half with, with the Senate, like, when are we going to make these people enforce term lim limits? Now, I understand that a lot of them don't want to do it because they want to be old, okay, and senile or, you know, have Alzheimer or fall off bikes like this, okay? And they want people to say, oh, well, no, I, I want to still be making that money. You know what I'm saying? The laundry is really good this time of year. So yeah, I just I I don't understand this. This is this is really crazy. And we see Pooper Pants Biden right here, just <laughs> no coordination whatsoever. And uh, I, I mean, he's just embarrassing. Like everybody's laughing at us. Here's my favorite. After this, I'm gonna stop. Like he's just gonna run, boom, on the. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so through. Anyway, anyway, I, I, uh, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm gonna stop it here. I just want to say this: term limits is needed now. Please enforce them. You know, what I'm saying I, I don't know. This is, this is elder abuse. And it seems like every elder that is being abused, I hate. So I don't have any sympathy. I'm just being honest here. Don't look, don't shoot the messenger, okay? I'm just being honest. This I can't think of one person that's elderly that still refused to leave is suffering a, a, a problem. Like, and uh, you know what people did? Hold on, I gotta say this because I just remember this. You guys remember when Mad Maxine uh, was behind Nasty Pelosi? aka nancy pelosi and she was just zoned out too like that you know i would go find that videotape but i don't feel like it you know what i'm saying but it's like she was like zoned out like this and and i these people are old and they need to i think there needs to be a cap that's what i think i think there needs to be a cap and how old you can be uh and serving in congress uh, I, I feel the same way with the presidency. All right. We don't need no more old men. We don't need no more old women. All right. I think this has to stop. But hey, I'm just me. You know, who knows? I'm the one who likes to laugh at elderly people I hate. So I could just be a bad person. But anyway, do you think I'm a bad person? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It'll turn me into a good person. And don't forget to share the video. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. That'll really turn me into a really super duper good person. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Later, taters.